you've said, like, you never got to go to college, right? Do you regret any of that? Do you, do you, um, do you say, gee, wonder what that would have been like, what I could have learned academically. Maybe it would have been kind of a fun time. No, I have this a massive chip on my shoulder about that. For you sure. do. Yeah. Because when you started with Twilight, which is a defining moment, mm. you said that was like your college education. And I, I don't think it's the education. No, I think it was the experience. social. Yeah, yeah. It was like hanging yeah. out with all those kids. Yeah. That was like the period of time where I was like, you know, drinking too much beer and like rolling to class, like, you know, cross-eyed. Was it so much fun in the camaraderie? I mean, not only were you falling in love with Rob on the set, which, by the way, I think is the biggest mistake an actor can make. Falling there was nothing I could do. <laughs> yeah. you, it was just, it was just, the director mm. was even nervous because mm. the first time you guys kind of auditioned you together or you, you would already had the part, but they ha- they put you together to see the chemistry. Mm. There was immediate chemistry between the two of you. Yeah. Yeah. It was it's pretty weird. Obvious. It's so weird. Like, t- like actually being honest about this is like, it's been so heavily consumed and it's like, I have this fear that people would assume that maybe I'm like, you know, it's kind of attention, like, oh, cool, you're still, like, pushing that narrative or whatever. It's like, no, I've actually never been allowed to just say what happened. Right. Because I was so self-conscious about seeming like an attention seeker, like somebody who was, like, taking, trying to... Or taking advantage yeah, of, exactly. the, of the fact that you guys were dating and yeah. stuff. People, I mean, I, I we were together for years. That was, like, my first, you, you know... I, Love. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I was super in love with my high school boyfriend, super, super fucking in love with him. But me and Rob were, like, a little older, and it was just, like, go gung. Um, but He's a charming guy. I yeah, mean, he's, I, he's the I best. Met, he's, he's really... He's the best. And, you know, that movie, especially the first one, the way you played it, and maybe, you, you know, it was just perfect. I was super aware that we were doing, like, a teen movie, and I had never done that before. I had done, like, very over-serious kind of, like, dramas pretty much my whole life. And then in this, I was, like, I wanted to do, like, a culty, weird, indulgent, just, like, full-blown, you know. I, don't, I It's weird to use the word girly now for anything, because I don't even know what that means. Are we talking about, what is that? Like, no, I don't know. it is a girly role. But it, it is it, the traditional, it it's feel, the Julia it Roberts. Amazing. Yes, it's Julia yeah. Roberts and yeah. Pretty Woman when she, you know, sees Richard Gere's superpowers. It's Lois Lane mm. it, seeing Superman. Mm. It is a girly, it's a traditional Hollywood girly role. That's yeah. why it's even more brave that you came out with your life and lived your life authentically, because people yeah. want to see you over and over again as that, that romantic girly role. 